What's up, everybody? Back again with another unboxing on today's episode. We got both of the Keldheim Commander decks. This is Pedro's, and this is mine. I got mine for Christmas. Cannot wait to open it, actually. It's going to be rather fun. And after we open these decks, we are going to battle each other. But in the last video, you seen that we got this cool play mat. Look at this beautiful thing. Pedro got it. It's actually Pedro's, but I said we because it's for the channel. It's for us. Exactly. And Pedro, he's the command cameraman like I always. I'm the command man. Hopefully you guys, you liked the last video. Yeah, blam. Stick Leave a like. Stand. Leave a like and subscribe. Comment on the video. See what you guys want to see. What you guys like and stuff. So I'm going to open this one. I'm going to open mine. Pedro's going to open his. Then we're going to see which one's better. So I'm going to push this off to the side. Let's get right into it. We got Ragnar. The ever watchful. As you can tell, I did. I almost opened it on Christmas, people. I came so close. Then I realized, okay, I'm going to save it for the video. So, see? Cow height. Let's do it. Now, I do have the elf deck, too. But that's been opened not forever ago, so. And... Which one of these is your guys' favorite? Let us know. I'd I like to know. See what you guys like. See which one you guys prefer better. The spirits or the elves. The elves, people. And this com it comes with a deck box for the deck itself, which I like. It is cool looking, too. There he is. Boom. Just be careful because it will get crushed if you pack it with other cards that are heavy. It is. That is true. It is fragile. fragile. After all, it is just cardboard. Yeah, but it is nice to have. You keep it at home. Yep, especially if you guys don't have a normal container or deck box that is sturdy. So that's perfect for it. It also comes with a learn to play commander. They should start throwing the sleeves in these decks. I agree. And it comes with a dice cool. counter. A die counter. If you do not use dice or anything, well, you guys can't. I really like one. these. Yeah, they are nice. Even though myself. I have dice, sometimes I still find myself using one of these. Just because, look at it. It just looks real nice. It is beautiful. Especially the blue. I like blue. It is the card itself. Ragnar. Flying Vigilance. The first card you foretell each turn costs zero to foretell. Whenever you exile one or more cards from your hand and or permanent cards from the battlefield, create a 1-1 one, one white spirit creature token with flying. Nice. And I do believe there's nothing in here. Nope. That is it. And the first card we see, Vanishing Light. I like that card. It's a good card. Not too shabby. I prefer to fully exile, but not too bad. Playing an enchantment deck. And I'm going to say, this is a rather weird one for me because I don't normally play blue-white. Okay. Hey, it comes with a nice little dragon thing. Yeah. Let's look at the tokens first. We got a bird and a soldier. Another bird and another soldier. Bird. Oh, spirit with them flying. That's cool. I like that. Too. What in the world? King, oh, no. King, King. King, soldier. Hey, Pegasus. Pegasus. Same thing. And then we got a boar and another spirit. What the hell? That's what boars look like this whole time? Boar, spirit, boar. It's wearing pants. Spirit, replicate, ring, and a thought. Then we got a dagon <laughs> and another thought. Put that off to the side. Hey, that came with some cool tokens, though. See what we got? Never Man. seen this deck before. Neither have I, so this is a new one for me. Cloud Goat. We got Abigail of Helio. Flicker Wisp. That's a nice card. Ghostly Prison. Nice. One of the best cards in here already. Gold Knight Commander. Core Cartographer. Oh, he's pretty nice. Momentary Blink. Oh, that's a nice. Nice sort of blink. Return to Dust, another great card in here. Wall of Omens. Then we got Ghostly Flicker, a great flicker card. Mist Raven. 
Mud Rifter, one of my favorites. Seagate Oracle. Well Roll. Windfall. Cloud Blazer. Infant Eagle. Hey, that's a pretty nice flying card. Yeah, that, would, that is nice. M migratory route, but that is nice. Not bad. Mist Metal Witch. Nice sort of card there. So Herder. I was just looking at this card on Facebook. I'm oh my god, yes. This card is so nice, people. Whew. Thunder clap. Wygrin. You gonna clap them cheats. Arcane Signet. Azora Signet. Those are nice. Burnish Heart. A great card. Great ramp card. Commander Sphere. Marble Diamond. Meteor Golem. A great card. Monstone. Hey. That's a good card. I can't. So happy I got that. Cosmetic Intervention. That's cool. Hero uh, Bredegood. Storic Farmer. Sage of Beyond. Spectral Deluge. Starkland Emilist. That's cool. I like their artwork on that one. Tales of the Ancestors. That's a cool card, too. Ethereal Valkyrie. That's cool. Ha! <laughs> Angel of Vitality. Ah, right, there you go, Pedro. Angel. Yeah. When I break this part, another angel. Cleansing Nova. Ooh, that's a good board wipe. Aerial Interlude. Geist Honored Monk. I got quite a lot of these. Martial Anthem. Then we got Restoring Angel. That's a cool card. Never seen that one before. Storm Herd. Sun Titan! <laughs> he's always in a pre-gun. Bro, he's, you can't go wrong with him, though. You can't. Yeah, I know, but at least they're a different artwork. You can't, you can't, nah. I do have the other artwork of Sun Titan, but this one's nice, too. It is nice. I'm not, I'm not hating on it. Arcane Autism. <laughs> Sorry, people, not Autism, but Autism. Curse of Swine. Jesus. Day of the Dragons. That's cool. It's hard to say magic cards. Oh, creatures you control. Oh, that might go on Miriam, people. Miriam. Inspired Sphinx. Synthetic Destiny. Brago, King and Turtle. I think yes. even get a Planeswalker in here. That's nice. I'm happy that I pulled in. He'd be a nice commander. Sky Diamond. Soaring. Swift the Abutis. Then we got the Azora's Guildgate and Chanacy, Command Tower, Cryptic Cave, Mandarin River, Mirrored Lamp State, Land, Landscape, Opal Palace, Sarah's Refuge, Tranquil Cove, and then Plains, 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 Island, Island, Island. Okay, more creatures. Perfect Iron Verdict, Warhorn Blast, Behold the Multiverse. That's cool. Raven form. Saw it coming. Nico Defiance Destiny. Aha, that's a good card. Vaga the Watcher. Or Replicant Ring. Gates of Entisfire. Glacial Floodplains. That's the deck, people. See what see if it plays well. If not, I'm still gonna take it apart regardless. But before I do that. We gonna play test each other's deck, see which one is better right out the box. See you guys. In see the next you guys. Day.